the armed conflicts involving the two former Soviet Union states, Kyrgyzstan and Tajikistan, broke out again. Gunfire between Kyrgyz and Tajikistan forces erupted in Lilik district, southwestern Betkan region, Friday, April 30, 2021. According to a report cited by Viva Military from Radio Free Europe Radio Liberty, RFERL, the death toll from the Kyrgyz Tajikistan war increased to 13 civilians. Not only that, 134 other civilians were injured in the clash. The conflict that has occurred since Wednesday, April 28, 2021, has prompted the Betkan regional authorities to evacuate 13,500 civilians from a number of villages along the border. Representatives of the governments of the two countries through their foreign ministers have actually agreed to hold a ceasefire on Thursday, April 29, 2021, at 14.00 GMT, or around 20.00 WIB. However, the Kyrgyz side strongly denied the Tajikistan's allegation that it was its civilians who started the conflict. Earlier, Tajikistan said it was Kyrgyz civilians who started throwing stones at Tajikistan citizens near the Golovnoya Dam. This was strongly denied by the Kyrgyz police in the Betkin region. Both Kyrgyzstan and Tajikistan have actually been involved in conflicts in the Batkin border region since 1991, after the collapse of the Communist Soviet Union. The Kyrgyzstan-Tajikistan war erupted as a result of a water infrastructure dispute, in this case the Golovnaya Dam. More than a third of the disputed Kyrgyzstan-Tajikistan border area lies in the vicinity of Verauk, an administrative area that is de facto part of the territory of Tajikistan.